Hello everyone, Terry Cruz here, and this is NHL 24 on EA Sports. Hey y'all, welcome back to another NHL 24 matchup. And we're about to settle things down as we're right now in this game. It's finally happening here. Happy New Year everyone, and it's 2024. Right now, this matchup is about to bring things on for the next game. We have the Never Canadian vs. the USA team. As right now, the Oilers are away, and the last season turned out to be a huge overtime winner over against the Winnipeg Jets. It's a lot of major Canadian team matchups, but we are looking for another game to hit up with the win. And they are facing at Buffalo to face against the Sabres. As right now, as the goaltender is turns it on, we have some, a lot of great moment to have it all. We start here on the first side as we go over to the Edmonton Oilers for the starting lineups on the on their team. This offense has turned out one of the best, but let's have a look of what's going here. Connor McDavid has an elite skating in with the puck. His ultimate move has a lot of elite settling with his own run and technique. He has it all down and last season was a turnout with the win successful run to punch their way to the playoff spot to face against the Kings in the first round. And then move it again to face against the never Canadian American team. It's a Golden Knights. And they have already lost right now at this point and it didn't turn out the way it used to be. As right now, Will this season work for Connor McDavid? We'll find out how well he does. Also, Leon Dreisen. His tape to tape feed his own, but a dry side of Ely Puck settling with a passing vision to find an open look. The shot angle has turned into one of the biggest measurements of the game, and we have to see how they can do. And Ryan Nugent Hopkins is the superstar player that turns to go with the third eye set. And a starting goaltender for the Edmonton Oilers will be Stuart Skinner. As right now, that will be the starting lineup for the Oilers. And on the other side, we have is the Buffalo Sabres. Jeff Skinner is the ultimate one that has his Ely edges on his run. Has a great agility and directional change, closing the corners and great strong close shooting range in the game. And make it snappy, great makes a snapshot and stride. On the other side, we have a Sage Thompson. Puck on the straight with the handling. They always beat up against the Oilers. That in their game got a great motion. This was a turnout to make that successful run to have it all. And finally, Rasmus Dahlin, a magic man. Elite edges here for the ability to have a directional change. We'll have a good show and angle. Will he have this run for Rasmus Dahlin? It will be enough to take it all. Now it's time to see what goes on with the next goaltender. And right now, we have is Levi. Devon Levi will have his own time to have a starting goaltender for tonight. And now I'm down, the next commentary I will have is OJ. Along with Son of Beast. And the center ice will be Silver Spoon. I'll be back with the post game show right on its way, so keep your eyes peeled. Now, let's get in to Buffalo at Key Lake Center. Guys, it's all yours. See you all later after the game. Hello everyone, it's OJ, and we are ready for another NHL matchup here in Buffalo as they face on against the Edmonton Oilers at Key Lake Center. It's the starting night of this matchup, and we are ready. Back to the first season in a Sabres country. Here we go as we start right now with the players. Me, OJ, along with Sam Beast, and Silver Spoon in the center ice. Here's Skinner. Has it across his circling emotion right now, finding touch. Touching his way down over again to Scott Samuelson, and now we're finding a look at the run. He's going. Samuelson gives it off the touch. Touch your run to find going. Shoots with a left angle. How that would have a good start by Skinner. His Skinner was a perfect angle there, and he does have it all because this is a lot of a hard strategy to make this maintain. This is why that Edmonton Oilers are always been turning out big time moments. 
They've got to figure something else out how to get them rid of it. Here's touch break down the angle and now pass off to Thompson. Thompson! In the middle, taking it away and now Brown will have it. Edmonton back in the offense zone in this Sabres territory. Paterko now finds Cousins. Secondary lineup on the fast break. Paterka now finds Olofsson and now gives off to Chikoro. Cousins right over again. Get bang! Cousins went down and now fighting over is Chikari. Cousins shot! That Nugent Hawkins went up his uh, rejection and Nurse will have it back. Dry side all over and down to Hyman. Hyman on his way down. Looks it over! That takes it away as Power gives it over to Cousins. He now finds Olofsson. Olofsson, his way down! Shot went wide! Here's Olofsson and now finding over again to Greenway. Nurse growling and says, get off of me. And Greenway over now and finding again to Power. Nugent Hopkins with the puck steal. Takes a bang and Greenway back again to Jakari. You can tell that it was a bit, a little bit unstressful to maintain it. This was no more joke. They just didn't really see what was going on like that. Because this was a hard makeout. Blocking out is not an optional. Cece with the puck after a save made by Skinner. Here comes Hyman. Hyman shot. Levi with the pad save underneath. The quarry over now to Johnson. Johnson lost the puck. Here's Holloway. All the way down over the game. Finding now with Cloy. Blocked up and took it away right hand. The Sabres are back in offense. Crimson on the move. Clear Fletcher scores. Oh, Pozo. Bounces first to Fletcher goal. Pass 241 of the game. This deflection turned out big because he went from pad and just gave it up that quick. Just really turned it out. And that was right in between from the chest in front of him and then just put it back in bounds. Scared to not see that one going by. His captain got that one in there for the start of a run. Looking good on the run as they have the early lead for the Buffalo Sabres. 1-0 over the Oilers. CC on his way down, ready to take the inbound. And he lost the puck. Goes into the Oilers territory. Alcohol will have the puck back. Oilers will have the puck in bound and now find Holloway. Rebound again and here comes Jamark. Jamark on his way. Pass to McCloy. Block by Dolan. Ogposer will have his first takeover on the other side of the uh, rink. Wall it over. Unable to give it off to Gergensen. Goes over and says, no way you can't stop me. It's because the Gergensen just really had to get that one away with it. His target was not always the offense. Samuelson gives over to Dolan. Dolan walked away and now fight back over again to McDonough. With under 14 minutes to go, it's a 1 0 lead. Stop by Lee Boy. Here's Samuelson. We'll have to give it over to finding to Skinner. And now Thompson's in for the Oilers territory. Pressure ahead. Here's Touch. Lost the puck. Samuelson will have it back. He gives it over to Samuelson. Now finds touch. Looks to Samuelson. Puck cleaves his own and now find Dolan will have it till never take any inbound. Here's Stalin will have the puck inbound. Takes it away. Short. He scores! Alex touch. His first goal in one ten of his career. Ultimate maker Alex touch. That was all it does. Cut him in, take him out. That's the pass that you can't just miss out on. He has a wide, wide open look ability around Skinner. That blinding has been taken over with his time angle, and he does have now have the point to get there. That saving turns out to be a 2 0 run for the Buffalo Sabres, and now they will have his own take as Kulak will have the win in the faceoff zone. Here's Johansson who will have Johnson now finds Olofsson. Takes a pass over now to Petrka. He now finds Cousins over again to Johnson. 
shoots! Stopped by Skinner. He showed up this time, and now Cousins will have it away. And the Olympic Hill has been called on the Edmonton Oilers. That's where the start does turn out. No way you can't just make that one slash. That's going to hurt them. Thompson back to Clifton, now over to Johnson. We see Clifton as he was been traded off to the Boston Bruins. But welcome to the team, Clifton. It's a lot of heavy take. Paterka scores, and they are not going to hit the power play this time. Well, that's all it does turn out. Because he has that one timing, and as Paterka has it all, he just took it right away and says, I got it. It took for me my encouraged spirit. Great move for Paterka, and he has that one out there. Skinner didn't really get there in time, and he just made out an easy look on this optional run. With no power play run, that's what it does turn out. And now they're ready to take on. 10 18 left to go. And now into the midway mark of the period. Patterson, Greenway stop, Ryan, and Levi save. Greenway lost the puck right down here, and now goes the other way. Pass stopped away by Levi. Patterson lost the puck in middle step, gives it over to Johnson. Pass over to Greenway. On oh, his way down the corner. Oh, he went big, big here tonight. That takedown is going to be like out of here. No pressure takeaway. Pop takes it over. Patterson gave it back to Kulak. Kulak his way. Oh, good stop by Levi. Just about under nine minutes remaining. As right now, they're ready for the faceoff. Both players ready to take the set into the offense zone. Free nothing is the score to take them hit and ready for the next one. Kolak. Oh, he lost that pass connection. Gurdjieffson will have it in. Deep pass over. Now finding Krebs. Jakoro right back to power. Looks over to Jakoro. Krebs takes it. Back can't stop. No can't get over this. The Oilers are back in the offense now by Eugene Hopkins. Hopkins lost the puck. Takes it over a bit. Eugene Hopkins back the other way. Jakar now finding it over into the corner. Now finds Ferguson and now power in the other side. Gives it to Ocpozo. Ocpozo lost the puck here. And they're going to need to make that change up. This is no way that they can't make the do this at the same time. There's no way that you can't try to make that fix. Because this is a lot of hard strength. They can't just leave him out. Behind it, there's no question to ask for what happens if there's a choice. Bang up into the bench zone. And here's Stalin. We will have a puck back and now find touch. Touch on his way down. Find Stalin. Stalin lost the puck. Oh, and he will have to bang that one out of here. And Dolan will have to give it off that quickly. Lost the puck. Holloway back to the other side with only six minutes remaining. Samuelson takes it away and now finds touch. Pass over to Skinner. Rebound the puck. Bouchard will have the puck taken away as he could makes a disconnected pass to Skinner. Here's McCloy. McCloy lost the puck. Dolan give back to Skinner. Oh, slammed down in the corner and now by Cousins. On his way down. Slows him up and crosses across the bar. Samuelson gives it over to Cousins. Now finds Shakura. McCloy takes the puck. Under five minutes remaining in the first period. Here's Jamar. Blocked by Skinner. Cross down. Took it away. That's a nice move when you have to go with Skinner. That's because, you know, take a look at this. That's what you need to get, get right out of here to just stop the inbound. Paterka on his way on the other side of the offense run now finds Samuelson. Samuelson gets pushed back. Pedersen now finds his Cousins. Cousins the backhand. Now we'll have to be out with that easy save by Skinner. Here's that call. We will have it over. At home. Couldn't find anybody, but now finds CC over to Brown. Looks to Kane. Oh, just say hello there, folks. As right now, Levi had that save and took it out of here. There's no way that they can't just leave him out behind. They just really can't seem to go the trick. 
Oh, Skinner made the save. Just a time right by. Under three minutes. This is tricky. Not a choice out there. They can't believe it. Rasmus Stellan is the ultimate man that has it all set with the elite edges on his sway. His ultimate skill power is a takeaway to make that one French for a triable and have it all. Conor McDavid has a lot of the wheels to take the loose. When the chain comes in quick, he has it all down to make that one making save of his run. The ability is stranger, guys. I'll be watching those two in between from Conor McDavid and also Ron, Ron, your dog, Rasmus Stalin. Right on the other side with the magic way. Back to you. Now fighting over again to Krebs. Krebs fights again to, to, to Johnson. Johnson lost the puck. Bouchard lost the puck and now over again to Johnson. He finds Greenway. 90 seconds to run in the first period and now here's Johnson. Passo, Passo, Skinner save. 116 remaining in the first period. That's right now they're about to get ready for an air face off. There has to be a lot of clear way to make the protection work. This offense is not always impossible, but they really got it all. Now the win for the Edmonton Oilers. Tate Thompson get it back this time. And, and they're try subtle that finds to Shortex. Only one minute remaining in the first period as Nugent Hopkins finds out Heitman. Good save by Levi. Puck clears out the zone. Icing will have to give it off to Buffalo as right now with only 45 seconds to remain in the first period. Now waiting for another one. It's a free nothing lead for the Buffalo Sabres. Buffalo didn't make the win but had that one taken away. As right now Edmonton Oilers have another face-off win. Here's Skinner. Johnson to find Clifton. Stick Clifton. Nugent Hopkins on his way down. Tries to look it over. And Thompson takes it away. Fires it out. And now we're in the first period. This run turns to be a deflection to take from here. We'll get to the second period when we come back after the break. Don't go anywhere, we'll be right with you after this. A start run grenade for the opposing team of the Buffalo Sabres, taking up a start of a 3-0 lead. Welcome back to Buffalo as we're about to start the second period of the night. And we're off to start. As we take a first recap look at the period, the dollar and the team has it all started up with the first run of the night in for, for the first start of the 3-0 run. How did that one took up their, their right away, Beast? Well, this is a lot of major career on this game. I know that the Buffalo Sabres are making the wild cards. You're looking for another run to try to take the shot on deck, but this is a lot that hard that they are trying to make this pressure. This team is a lot that hard to make it successful run. I have to maintain that this is a hard one that they are trying to get away with us. Back to Dolan. Open look! Shot went too wide as Dolan will have to give it over to Skinner and now find Samuelson. Here's touch. His way now! Got can't stop by Skinner and now Nurse has it over again. Oh man, this was a lot that hard save. And this is a lot of taking inbound for the goaltender to try to reach from here. Now Don will have it over to Skinner. Skinner gives up to the touch. Touch on his way down. Samuelson looks over. Skinner with the save. Go up to the up. And we're ready to take an over face off here with only 17.34 left. And we'll make it the first second. Now ready for an earth face off look. The Buffalo Sabres are on a power night to think over the Canadian run, a 3-0 lead. Now CeCe will give it over to Eckholm. Hyman on his way down on the right side. Watching here, Jokari! Good tuck, good takeaway for the puck, and now Cousins will have it. CeCe takes it over, and now Hyman will on his way down. Dry side on his way. Here's it up, kids! Oh, gloved it up with the save. That's another one for Levi. Power finds Jokari. Looks it over to Venture Pet. And behind Cousins. Looks at Olsen. Shot! Taken away here, big! 
The Oilers are on their way back to the offense run into the Buffalo territory. Looks it in! Rebound stopped away by the goaltender. Buffalo back the air away as now Benson gives over to Greenway. We'll have to wait for Mir, and now the team is back into the, into the offense zone. Here's Benson. Benson backs it up, now finds Clifton over to get to Johnson. Greenway backs it up now. Benson gives it over, another look at the face off run. Johnson fired! Good projection here for the Olaf Steve. As the Oilers takes it away. Shot stopped again here by Skinner. Cousins on his way down. Finds again to Greenway. Greenway! Another huge save. Here comes Big by a goaltender. And it's still going! Lifting on his way back. And a puck leaves out of the zone. This offense is nowhere to be out there on the luck there, OJ. This was a lot of courtesy. His strength does not have it all. His time ability does have it all, but they can't be leaving it out of here. This is what everyone does. They're trying to make it quick. Skinner, right now. That's another stage made by Skinner on the other side. And Touch lost the puck. The audience regained the group. Flies it out. And their group is getting tired right now. They are still need to rehydrate more. And Thompson, on his way. I'm going to straight loose. Oh, man. Skinner got that save here as Tate Thompson didn't have the right call to do it. Trying to get it this big time. Save me! Skinner rebounds the puck and now finds again to Clifton. Good the shot! Logged it up by Skinner and he will have to hold the puck with just 12.45 left. Man, the puck has been blowing up for a buffalo over the night. They're doing really well. Yeah, I know. Because how hard this is, there's no way they, can, they can't just get them out without the face off puck. To make that one feel like they're on all the way in a grip chain, this is a lot that hard strategy that nobody has ever done it before. And I know that it was a hard one to maintain. Here's Samuelson will have the puck right away. He's lost the puck at this time and now finds Touch. Touch finds again to Skinner. Skinner again! Touch shot! Skinner stop! Under 12 minutes remaining in the second period, as right now this one comes into a free two. 3 0 to all lead. Now with the win, here's a call. Now gets off to Hyman. Moves quickly to Nugent Hopkins. Spreading around. Oh, Levi! What a big save, me! And at only 11.41 to remain in the second. He's good at it right now. If you can tell that Levi is already there, he's got pretty good with this angle. Good call. Now with the win for Eckholm, Dry Slido is right toward the back. The puck leaves his own. And now they're back in to do it again. CeCe over now in the other side of his own. Pass to Nugent Hopkins. Finds Dry Slido. Looks fine to Nugent Hopkins. Eckholm, long shot. It has been choppy and it's over again. Back the other way to Gurgensen. This is a hard one to maintain. This choppy motion is not going to be easy enough because that was a little bit off. He has to pay for a new stick to get that one back in. CC on his way down. Highman lost that puck. Battle for the puck with a loose. Between the board. Cousin takes it away. Eckholm takes it over. Now he's in our one for Jamark. Jamark over right now in the corner. Pass to McCoy. Save me by Levi. Buffalo Sabres are back in the offense zone from the corner. Paterka gets bangled out by Deshari. Jan Mark finds Kulak. Here's Holloway. Back now to Deshaharis. Looks it away. And Powell will regain it. Paterka back the airway now finds Cousins. Just about 8.50 left to remain in the second period and now back to McCloy. Puck taken away here is a lot of choppy motion out there. Now finds Paterka. Paterka has moved to a one. Skinner. Got a good stop here this time before the puck came in. They're in that close call this range. This is not where it does turn out. You don't want to make a mistake out there if you want to save it here that big. And you need that one big moment. You have to believe on that. 
Thompson, wow, took it away here with a battle for the loose put, and now have it back to the Buffalo Territory. Jakari shot! Deflection didn't see that one coming for touch. This is right now another goaltender save. Skinner spins around. That save may comes in by Skinner. Skinner back again to Thompson. And Thompson will have to regroup here by Clifton. This place keeps going. And a penalty been called by Buffalo. Thompson now fighting to get a touch. And there you have it. The power play comes in. For the Sabres, the Avenger King in the penalty box will have their first penalty kill for the Edmonton. That's always easy enough now because that slashing, that got a big kill. Sabres are on the start for the power play run with only just down to seven minutes remaining in the second. Now with the win as Nurse will take it over. Closes away. And now Thompson will have his chance with the team to take the power play run on ahead. Here comes Milstad. Milstad. The Turkish shot. Oh my. That to Skinner made that one a big save. Dolan now find Benson over now to Dolan. The Turka covers it up. And can't get it to go. Dreisaitl has it away. Clears the puck out in the Sabres territory. Here's Middlestad now finds again to Paterka. Pass deep to Thompson. Can't get it to go. Over to now. Benson. Skinner save. Dolan over on the outside. Looks in bound. Taking a big here. And as the number one comes up by the defender. Paterka finds Dolan. Now finds Benson. Full pressure ahead. Milstad can't get the puck away from it. And it's still going to keep going. This place going to be out all night. And Thompson has it already been turning out just away. Looks like Kane's ready to get out there on ice. The Buffalo Sabres are unable to take their power play run, and this time has already been expired. A lot of takes in between for Skinner and their team. This is no way to get started. You have to cover the man. But this was a great successful run. They are trying to leave open them with the mark. They just really have to get there fast. Thompson shot. Not able to take the deflection in as Millsack gives back to Dolan. Shoot to the net. Gloved up by Skinner. Oh, that is a tough shot. But great save by Skinner as the goaltender comes in big. As Dolan got banged up. This is a lot of defenders that were getting their big. As Evander Kane is always saying, I'm coming for you. He's already been taken down that big. Yeah, of course what it is does turn out. You're going to get away with that one. Kulak with the puck. On his way through. Levi with the stop save. Sabres are back in the offense zone. Deep pass. We'll get it up. The shot is the ball away. McCloy with the puck and now find Powers. Powers gets over to Jakar. Jakar gets pushed. McCloy takes it back. Save again by Levi. Holloway shot. Oh, he did not have the right timing out there. He just went there and he just showed up. That's what happens now. You don't make the mess out of them. That's what you always do. Brigginson. Oh my. That's Skinner got that one near the goalposts. Jab walk right over now into the center of the ice with 2.30 left to go. Here's Kulak. Down his way further, Levi stop. 2.19 remaining in a second. It's still going to be a long, playful night for the Buffalo Sabres to get there. And that's a lot of big smash out there. This is what happens now. The Buffalo Sabres are getting destroyed. Now the win for the face-off of the Sabres. Benson can't get the puck yet to go. Here's the Shores. That crotch down. Greenway stop. Big David. Oh my goodness. Another huge save for the Buffalo tonight. They're just going to say, not a choice. This is whatever happens if they're going to get away with that. And you can't just get away with anyone else that could try to stop you from being left behind 
That's a lot of stalls, like stocking out. This motion run is heartless. The late penalty has been called on cross checking. That will be on Kulak in the penalty box. There's no way that you can't make that with a cross checking that motion mark. This is whatever happens, you're going to leave that mark out and you're seriously going to get hooked. Sabres on his way down with a power play run to start with an orange one. Two penalty kills for Edmonton Oilers, and they're ready to do it again. The Sharks finds that comb, and now we'll have to take it over on the other side. Here's that comb now finds to Mark. Poke it away by Thompson. Last man will remain in the second period. Stoked away by Levi. Touch on his way down in the corner. Looks to Cousins. Oh, poked it away by the goaltender. Jamar takes it over. Crosses out. And looks like that the Buffalo Sabres will have some time. And looks like another penalty has been called. Now this calls for Jamar. Does a slash call. Not a way to make that one successful. Because this is whatever happens. They're getting killed. They don't want that. They just need to find somebody else to try to stop them. Now the Sabres have a 5 on 3 attack in the Ellen Oilers territory. Now the win for Nurse. Goes right over to get to CC. CC on his way down. Takes it big! Wow! What a make here! And Skinner had that save earlier. Oh my, I have to tell you now, this is whatever happens. He just went back. From the back, that's going to be boom. Suck a lucka later. <laughs> that's what you always call that when you're. I love that hop move. That's a lot of courtesy out there. Saving up of the win. Here's Dolan Shot. Stopped away by Edmonton. Dolan trying to make a move. Oh, Skinner save. That's a huge make out. And he's still not quitting. This always happens to be like this there, OJ. You're getting over this. They're trying to make it done. And that will be with the base off at the end of the second. So it's still no thing, but a lot of great saves in between of the goaltenders. A lot of shots, take out defenders. We'll be right back with the third period. It's coming up right after the break. See you later in just a bit. It's about that time. The third period of regulation comes down to this. And we are set. Well, it's been a one heck of a night. The Sabres are on a strong run, and it looks like they're ready to do one last time to have it all. What do you think how they did here, guys? Well, it's a lot of art on this one. I gotta say the Buffalo Sabres are keeping the man-on-man -man advantage. This is a lot of courtesy that they are just trying to struggle them to face them on. They are really on to a home star. I love when they do the setup, they get it going. in the making right now as Jeff Skinner has already been on a crushable run on a takeout run to take him away. You know that Jeff Skinner has always been doing it. This is a lot of encouragement but they're doing a lot of bare moment out there to just keep their eyes on run. That's what happens most of the time because most play teams in the Buffalo Sabres, they're already just making that one slapping it out. This is a lot of motor courtesy moment to make that setup go into a playable run. I'll be watching here if Jeff Skinner can take it over once more. Back to you guys. Oh man, that's another huge save by Skinner. Benson tries his way, now finds Stolen, now goes to Thompson. Here's Thompson on a shot run, it's blocked away. Campbell will have him replaced here as right now Skinner is on the bench and he is finished for the season. Yeah, that's because of the great way to say that Campbell is going to be able to take it over and have it all down. He might have it all that all that he can take. 
Here's Simon, he will have the puck here in the settling zone as the power play has already come down to an end. And now they're back to full strength. Joyce Seidel, he might got a good stop with the save. Here's Olafson now finds again to Cousins. On his way now, looks now over towards again to Petroka. Samuelson lost the puck. Gives off again to Samuelson, and now Dolan will have it back. Trying to make a cut move. In the middle! And the Bundle Manual Defender take away, and now Paterka tries to give up to Samuelson. Now find Dolan. Shoots away! Campbell had that one a good save. That's his second one for tonight. That's Campbell's with a lot of pressure take. This is an offense run. They just need to get there and right away. Blocked by Dolan! The Sabres are back in the offense zone. Pick up another run. Thompson on his way down in the corner. Find Stalin! Good take, but it's a save by Campo. Puck goes over the net, and we will have a whistle ready for the faceoff. Now the Oilers will have the win, as now Bouchard will have it over to Kane. Kane on his way down. Power takes it over. Now Skinner will have it on his way down to the other end. His team has already been coming in there. Nurse takes it over. Bouchard now finding now to McDavid. Lost the puck zone. Thompson takes it back and now into the offense side. Slips it up. Miss way in. Cuts. Oh, Kane got that one with the save. This one is coming in hot. Now a lot of hustle and taking inbound is a lot of hard strength. This is a lot of courage and motion here, here, folks. Not enough way, they can't get away with that. With the new change, McDavid, Kane, and taking away with deflection off the skater on the defender. Clifton takes over now to Benson. Benson lost the puck. Johansson gives over to, to Greenway and now find Millstack. Shot shot, blocked away by Bouchard. Nurse on his way. McCloy on his way down to the Buffalo Territory. Edmonton Oilers still need to get the goal right away. And Clifton takes it over. Middlestack slows it down and now he will give it off to Clifton. Back to Middlestack. Back to Greenway. Now swing it over to Samuelson. Lot of pass. Oh, Benson didn't get the one-time goal. Greenway stop. Way back again. Oh, and the Campo had that one a good save. This inbound keeps it going. The stronger it takes, it's a lot that hard, but not always a, uh, as playable, but they're going to get away with that. Samuelson, carrying is it offside, as right now it's only 247 left to remain in the third period. Still a lot of time left to remain in the period. Sabres are on a run with a 4-0 lead. As we've seen the last season, they made a great win against the Dallas Stars at Dallas. They made that one a stop run for a 5 3 run. Yeah, they're always that good because you can't just get away with that. He scores! Oh, wow, the Sabres are on a fun night. They're always happy enough. They're just going to have to try to say it's their, it's their city night edition of the Sabre Town. They're always saying that they're going to send out a good open target. Beats Campbell right around it. And that's where you know you've got to make that hit. The Sabres extend their lead. A 5 nothing run over on the Edmonton Oilers. They are always a great strong start for the first and now the third period close the gap. They are doing a lot much better with this offense, just like last season. They're already been turning out big. The Buffalo Rams are just going to be turning out like the Ram on the run. The Bills are on a chain. There's no way that they can really stop there behind. This pressure is turning out that big. I just can't really say I'll tell you that this is a lot that hard majority that they're always been turning out. And now I can't just say is they're just on tons of. Bills, Sabres, on the run. Yeah, <laughs> that's a lot of like the same team, just like the football does. Olafson back again, now by Samuelson. A lot of great pass motion out there for the Sabres. They're always on a great start. 
The Sharks finds Brown. Here finds McDavid. And Kane on his way down, saved by Levi. He now finds Shikari and now over again to Paterka. Paterka lost the puck and Nishonis will have it away down to Kane. Hipped away. Paterka takes it over and now finds Shikari. Duco over finding Olofsson. Pulls it around again to Cousins. Cousins on the corner. Fire to Canada but it's deflected on the Campo and Cousins gives it back over to Kikoku. Brown takes it back. One on one! Shot stopped by Levi. What a save! He says a lot that timing. I can tell you now, there is no way that it was a ton once the cat carried in the watch what happens. This Thompson fire once, as right now it's a lot of great maturity to pull it out. That's a big tough one to stop in by for the Sabres goaltender. Touch finds Jokoku. Now finds Skinner. Skinner fires the shot. Hits another huge save here by Kipo. Jokoku gets slipped back. And Touch will have his on his way down into the run. Looks for an open run now finding Skinner. And he lost the puck that time. Their team still not giving up with the passes and they're still keeping it going. This is a lot of hard majority, but they're just keeping the pass open. They just need to keep on going faster and faster. Thompson! Oh, that's Campbell may not save. 7-13 left to go in the third period. It's a good run to be here for another face-off. Now let's get back into another face-off. Five nothings to score but a save us to keep the run on. Runs it up with another win for the Oilers, but the Grizzlies will have it back. Johnson lost the puck as they will have to take his way down, now finding fine spreads. Rakensen right into the corner. This offense gives off to Rakpozo. Uchar takes it over. Hyman takes it over with the, with the puck in the corner. Looks over. Lost that puck paddling. Holy by! Now finds Kurgensen. Now gives off to Krebs. Krebs on a fast break. Opposal in the corner now finding Johnson. Look at this play. Oh, Krebs got a good look, but it's another huge save by Campbell. Here's Lucian Hopkins. Pass the Hyman shot. Levi save. 5.30 left to remain, and they are always on a pyro run. They're just trying to shut them down in the periods. This wet hard one does turn out. If there is another way to get this, they just can't just get away with that and say, oh yeah, we're just going to have to try to shut them down on one of the players in the offense. They know what they're going for. They've got a lot of big power runs here. They're just keeping it going big. Edmonton Oilers are back in the other, uh, other side, as right now, here's Ryan in the corner. Fires a shot. Another step textbook saved by Levi. Benson on his way down in the corner. Diagonal pass to Greenwood. Pass! That's taken over and Pedersen over now. Battling with a loose puck. Here's Pedersen now into the offense zone. Pass to Fogel shot. Pull it up big. What a save me. And now gives it up. Levi! Wow, oh wow. Got a little bit of a battle takedown with the rebound here. <laughs> yeah, they do. Because Levi has it all. Campbell looks safe as Cousins has the backhand, but stops it with only 3.11 to go. Looks like we got an answer. Let's go over to Silver Spoon. I love when the hustle test turned out that Rasmus Nolan is feeling a lot much better to take the early edges. Even though he doesn't have the goal to take, he's a lot of ones to maintain his offense. He's doing really well, folks. The Buffalo Sabres are always saluting him to make him magic. Brown, in the middle. Hit the goal post that keeps it out. Echo takes it over, and McDavid has it now into the center. Dahl on his way, rebound, and he will have it back. Evander Kane takes it back in. This time it's now a 5 1 game in the third. It has been so long that it's a lot of great takes here for the Levi, but now Evander Kane has it all. 
Because of Connor McDavid is giving it off to Evander Kane right away. Puck on a string, and then keeps it right in it. Now they have the goal. No way that they can get the shutout runs. They can try to like just get back into this one to go again. Five points to score with only two, three, three left to go in the third period. As right now, Epcom has it. Here's Kane, now gives it over to McDavid. Oh, Levi had that one saved. Here comes Skinner on his way down to the left. Has his first goal. Tries to push him across. Touch in the corner of the net. Power bit in the back. McDavid takes it over. Ooh, he got that one blocked away. Chicago right now fighting Thompson now gives off to Skinner. Oh man, he will have to hit that, feel that heat tomorrow. This offense is going big and big. Offside is the call and just one more look. That is a lot of a truck, uh, touch tolerance. That was a lot of a heavy motion. Do you have to complain about this? Nobody does. <laughs> I, I don't know if it will be, but I will be feeling like this is a, like a ram tornation. Right like the football tacklers. Wow. A lot of Isaac Newton's third generation law turning out big. Johnson gave up the scare, we're right down to the last bit to go. Skinner and the team has been already been picking up strong. They're just going at it a long way down. This is a lot of heavy takedowns that we all proceed. They are big ones successful tonight. That's when you know the Buffalo Sabres won last season in the away games. And now this season does happen to be another huge win. That's what happens. They just take it over and over. And Greenway will have it. Time takedown as Nurse will have it over. And Greenway will take the puck back to Clifton. And that is it. The Buffalo Sabres takes a win over the Edmonton Oilers with a crush on run. 5-1. It's all what happens now because Levi is a, a rookie of the year goaltender. He's amazing. And this is what he does to salute to everyone. While I can definitely tell you we can all salute our fans, we love their support. And this is a fan favorite Buffalo Sabres to have their second win of the season. Well, so that's it right now. OJ along with Southern Beast and uh, Silver Spoon of Sarah Rice. This has been a presentation of the NHL 24. Thanks for so much for joining with us, and we'll see you all again next time. Good night, everybody. All right, thank you so much. We go down to the three stars. Rasmus Gallen, two assisted by hits. Magic Run. Then Kyle Pozo, a goal, assisting two hits. All does turn out with the pass and take the goal in the first period. And ladies and gentlemen, Devon Levi takes the first star of the player of the night with 29 saves. 7.1% is about best saving ability, and has it all down with a rage run. Here's how they do with the total statistics of this game. We have a lot of courtesy runs here for the 52 over 30 for the Buffalo Turtle shots, but that was a lot of bunch of saves by Skinner, and he was already been left down the ice, and we'll give it over again to another player of the goaltender by Campbell. 57 over 39 for Edmonton Oilers. Then 13-10 over 342 from the Buffalo Sabres on a time on the top. 85 over 81 for the Edmonton Oilers. Still on a good run. But there's still a lot much pass to be done. 28 faceoff wins over three for Edmonton Oilers. Been picking up a great steam. A lot of takedowns in between to smack them. This was a lot that much that nobody has ever seen. Like this one. And right over again with a six minute penalty call, they got a power play goal for the Edmonton, nope, sorry, Buffalo Sabres. They have a power play goal. One out of three Buffalo power play goals. And with only the power play minute, 448 to remain. That's a great run for the Sabres to hip up with the win. And we will see how well they do if they enter in for the postseason. Well, that's it for the run, as right now, Terry Crews is out. Thank you for watching, and we'll see you all in the next game, as we've got the Rangers, the New York, battling against the other team of the Carolina Hurricanes, here playing at PNC Arena.
in Raleigh, North Carolina. We'll find out what happens if there's another way to take them down. So that is it for now. Peace out, everybody, for a while as the NHL 24 dial. And this is Terry Crews. Follow him for Son of Beast on his social media on X, Instagram, and TikTok. Link in about page. And feel free to subscribe and like the video. And if you have any suggestions, leave a comment down below. And hit the notification bell. The best way to support for his channel. Thank you so much for everyone for tuning in. I'll see you all again for the next game. Good night in Buffalo and Edmonton. If you don't, if you don't, somebody will.